part two. Here we go. Um, to do this one, it, we need a work point on there. And the easiest way to do that is to um, create us an offset plane. If you will, I mean, there's several ways of doing it. Uh, we can go tangent surface parallel plane. And that is the plane I want it to be parallel to. And I want it to be tangent here. Let's look at it. Yes, that's good. Okay. So we'll do a sketch on that plane. And let's place a point right there. And we'll give it a vertical constraint from the origin. Oh, what happened? Where did my point go? I don't see where it went. Let me undo that. It must have jumped up in here. So let's give it a vertical constraint here first. So let's uh, slice our graphics. And now that um, let's project geometry of that cylinder. I didn't get the center point of it, did it? Ah, okay. Let me back up. Uh, next part of the plan that would be down 96 from the origin. So I can dimension the point. Down 96. And there it sits right there. And so now I can do the vertical constraint. Or horizontal constraint. No, not horizontal. Uh, vertical. That's what I thought it should be. Uh, huh? Uh, this is where. Okay. This is weird. So we'll just go ahead and bring our y axis to visibility. And do a coincident between that and the y-axis. There we go. That's what I want. Finish sketch. Hide the work plane. Do a hole. Whoa! Check that out, dude. Okay, it's a it's a threaded hole. So let's go back and get my right sizes. And this one is an M10, I think. Yeah, M10 by 1.5. Um, it's threaded full depth. Uh, but instead of going through all, we're going to go to that point. All right. So that's got uh, that's got all my major features put in. Now we want to start filleting. And if you remember, we want to do outside fillets first or rounds and so our fillets are all three three millimeters right yes okay so let's do our our rounds first and then we've got these bottom edges here It's really hard to tell that in the book, but they are. Okay, and now we can do all our in our fillets, our true fillets. And so let's do that one out of the way. And let's go. Let's see. What do we get here? This may be a little cantankerous in here. So um, what happens if we go loop? It didn't like it. 
So we won't go loop. We'll stick with edge. Let's get that out of the way first. That's good. That and that, and we can just keep going around. All right, that brings us back to this little deal here. Ha ha, what do you know? <laughs> that worked out sweet. Okay, fillets there. Fillets there and there. Rounds and fillets, fillets and rounds. Okay, looks good. Now we'll go um, apply our material type. It's a cast iron part. And just like last week, we'll make our drilled holes and surfaces, finished surfaces, anything that's white in the textbook that doesn't have that color. Um, we'll make those uh, material changes. All right, so I got my materials applied to it. Um, my polished and my brushed and my crumbs and it's all looking good. Um, one thing I want to uh, caution you about is uh, b before you finalize your part and go to your drawing, go ahead and hide visibility on, on any of these planes or axes. If you've got any work planes created, anything that's showing up in this view that you really shouldn't see like dimensions or unconsumed sketches. Um, hide those. If it's an unconsumed sketch, delete it. You don't need it in your project. And uh, there we go. Now the drawing um, is pretty simple. Okay, front, top, right side view, isometric view with a, a large scale detail of the keyway because there's a specific way to dimension key slots. Page 525, I believe it is yes page 525 if your keyway is not dimensioned correctly it will be points off be aware of that um and so yeah anything that can go into that large detail view that's where you dimension it okay don't forget your center lines um there's not a whole lot you need a metric box Six millimeter text, 12 millimeter box. Um, tolerances, whole notes, those kinds of things, okay? Uh, it all looks, you know, the drawing itself is really pretty simple. So if you got questions, come see me.